NBC7's What's Up is sponsored by Bill Howe Plumbing, Heating, and Air, Flood and Restoration. We know how. I'm Greg Bledsoe, and this is your morning update for Wednesday, October 28th. Three people have died, and a fourth is in the hospital after police say a suspected stolen car that they were following crashed in the Mount Hope area. This was at the intersection of Market Street and Raven Street about 11 o'clock last night. According to police, the San Diego police helicopter was overhead when that SUV crashed into a pole. The driver and two passengers were killed. Let's take a look right now at our latest coronavirus numbers. There were 269 new cases reported yesterday. That's a positive test rate of about 3%. There were also seven new deaths reported. That brings the county's total now to 877. Two new community outbreaks were identified. One of those came from a daycare and the other one from a business setting. And at a special board meeting last night, members of the Vista Unified School District unanimously approved some new criteria for how to handle cases of the virus on campuses. Uh, this comes after at least six students tested positive for the virus just last week, and Mission Vista High School will have to shut down now for a couple weeks at least. Uh, middle schools and high school campuses will now close if two or more students or staff members test positive. Also, the new guidelines say if at least three campuses have one case each, all three of those schools would shift into online learning for two weeks. In the meantime, most students in the San Diego Unified District will not be back on campus until January, they know now. That's when the district plans to start phase two of its reopening plan. They announced that yesterday. On January 4th, pre-K through 5th grade students will go back to class four days a week for half days. And then on January 25th is when 6th through 12th graders will go back. They'll go back two days a week for full days. Firefighters are still battling those two large wildfires in Orange County. The largest of those two is the Blue Ridge Fire, and that's the one burning near Yorba Linda. It spread to around 14,000 acres. It is now 16% surrounded. Just got an update on that this morning. Cal Fire says at least one structure has been destroyed. And then just south of there, the Silverado Fire has now burned more than 13,000 acres. This is the one just east of Irvine. It's 25% surrounded now, so the firefighters made some progress overnight. This morning, nearly 70,000 structures are still threatened. And according to the Orange County Fire Authority, between both fires, about 80,000 homes have been evacuated. Los Angeles celebrating its second championship in a month. First the Lakers, now the Dodgers. Dodgers beat the Rays 3-1 to one in Game 6 of the World Series last night. However, there was a major curveball, you could say, late in the game. Another story grabbing headlines this morning, and that's because Dodger third baseman Justin Turner was pulled out of the game after testing positive for COVID-19. Then he was seen back on the field during the celebrations after the game, even posing in the team photo. It's not clear right now if he got clearance to go back out or if he was maybe violating the MLB protocol, so we'll see. The city of San Diego, in the meantime, is offering families a safe trick-or-treating option. 27 rec centers throughout the city are now open for families to enjoy contactless grab-and-go candy events. You can either walk, walk up or in some locations you can drive up to the centers where each kid will be given a bag of candy for free. We'll continue to bring you the latest here on the pandemic on NBC7.com and on TV. You can also listen to our podcast every morning today in San Diego, wherever you normally get your podcasts. In the meantime, stay safe. Have a great rest of your day. NBC7's What's Up is sponsored by Bill Howe Plumbing, Heating, and Air, Flood, and Restoration. Call 1-800-BILL-HOWE. We know how. Bill Howe is a family-run company that is as diverse as their services. Promotes employees from within and gives back generously to the San Diego community. I am Bill Howe. I am Bill Howe. We are Bill Howe. We are Bill Howe. Because, because we, we know how. how.